Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guide. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist clients from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services for their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. Now, one of the services that our clients most frequently ask us to perform is the SIM unlocking of a device in order to be used with a different network other than the one that originally sold it. By default, most devices are going to come with some sort of lock that restricts them to only being used on that original carrier or network, and they have to undergo some sort of unlock process in order to be used with a different one. Now, here with us today, we happen to have an LG V30, originally from T-Mobile here in the U.S., we can see the V30 symbol there on the back. And this is actually one that has not yet been SIM unlocked because as we can see here, we get the network lock message on the screen when we have a different SIM card inserted, one that does not run on T-Mobile's network. We're making this video to let all of our clients know that we do offer a service to be able to get this phone unlocked for other carriers. And that's actually something that we're going to run right here right now while the phone is connected as proof that we can do it. Before that finishes up, we're going to go ahead and jump into the settings and show you exactly what we're working with. So if we go under the hardware information, we can see there that we are dealing with the H932, which is the T-Mobile variant of the V30. And a couple years ago, T-Mobile went away from the standard unlock code mechanism, and instead they started preloading this device unlock app on the phones whereby they control the SIM unlocking of all their devices. So normally they would require you to meet all of their requirements in order for them to do it for you, but we're making this video to show all of our clients that that is something that we can do with our own computer programs and tools so that you don't have to go through T-Mobile. A lot of times that'll require you to be the original owner of the device, or you have to have it active for X number of months on their service, or yada, 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 whatever the requirements are. But this process allows us to manually unlock it without having to go through their systems. And actually my uh, program here just finished up, so the phone should be restarting. And then in another couple of minutes, we should be able to see that it does work now on that SIM card that we have inserted. I can go ahead and unplug that there. And then we'll just need to wait for the restart to initiate here. Seems to be taking forever. Come on, there we go. So we've got our V30 logo there, and we should see the T-Mobile symbol pop up after this now. Yep, there we go. Okay, so it comes up to the lock screen here, and we don't see that network lock message anymore like we were before with the SIM card inserted, so that's a good signal. Let me go ahead and swipe that away, and then while we give it a minute to connect to the network, we'll go and jump into the network settings. Okay, just need to make sure that the network mode is set correctly. Yep, we should be good. Okay, and there, now that we've registered on our SIM card under the network settings, well, first of all, we'll show you. So we are registered on Cricut there. That shows as a network, if my Zoom will cooperate there. There we go. Cricket's a prepaid provider that runs on AT&T's network here in the US. So that's the SIM card that we have inserted. And if we actually go to the network settings, we will show that we are actually registered on Cricket there with our signal and everything enabled. So this T-Mobile LG V30 has now been SIM unlocked for use on other GSM carriers here in the U.S. So if you have an LG V30 from T-Mobile and would like to get it SIM unlocked, we would love to help you out with that. So go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description. And I'll also put a slide at the end of the video here that has all the information there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out all the other videos that we have on our channel as we offer a lot of different services for a lot of different devices. And I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy. Make sure to hit that subscribe button while you're there also to be notified of all the new videos and services that we're constantly adding just like this one. Y para todos los hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes nos pueden contactar sin duda.
thanks for watching everyone and have a great day.